Nordi Aldi, Mimini's, Corny's, and Minya, Nganadi Pauli's. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. People have just been so keen to see the finished project and uh, uh, I think it's come up really lovely. The tours that we've had during the construction period have been really well attended. But just admit, I'm, uh, I'm very impressed uh, the way that the facility's been drawn together, the way it's been incorporated into the library. I think it's going to be an outstanding development for Mount Gambia. I think it's always important that uh, we have thriving regional communities because that's where a lot of our produce comes from the future. So to have a centre that can cover cultural, heritage and uh, some business needs, I think it's very important and it's a good blend. I understand that in choosing the theme for the design of the building, the council sought to identify what is unique with Mount Gambia. The selection of earth, fire and water is an excellent choice. The community-based Brittick Art Centre now enjoys significantly improved accommodation with climate control systems that will allow it to retain A-class exhibition standards. And of these, the former dress circle of the King's Theatre has been remodelled into a theatrette with state-of-the-art digital projection technology. I think other key features of the development will be noticeable this evening after dark. In particular, I understand there'll be an evocative light projection against the building, a light and sound feature telling the Dreamtime story of the Aboriginal people of this region.